Hey, how the devil are you? Just a quick little video. Um, so I downloaded Windows 11. Even though they said, we're not going to do any more past 10. Liars! <laughs> we're on Windows 11. Anyway, that's another story. Uh, so far, I'm happy with it. I've only downloaded it this morning. Um, I could have downloaded it earlier, but I just haven't got around to it. Uh, so I downloaded it today. And uh, I quite like it. It's okay. Uh, the layout seems good. It's a few things which are meh, and a few things which are meh. <laughs> but, um, uh, and also, I don't know whether this is just me. Uh, let me know if you find this. But Windows 11 does seem a little bit faster, a bit more snappy than Windows 10. Whether that's the case or not, uh, I'm finding it. Um, but uh, let me know if any of you guys are also. So here's the problem I come across already after literally and with, within an hour of using it. So there's an app called Snipping Tool. And I'm sure a lot of you use Snipping Tool on Windows 10. And it's looking like this at the moment. I don't know whether the app has, has been finished. <laughs> it doesn't look like it is. I mean, that's, that's new there. Uh, I haven't seen that before. But here's the problem. When I click New, I get a message. Copy the clipboard close. Now, I click clock, copy the clipboard. Uh, I suppose it just copies what you're seeing to clipboard. But that's not really what you want to do. And when you press Windows logo key plus Shift plus S to start the snip, nothing happens. It doesn't work. So very disappointing because I use the snipping tool quite a lot, and I'm sure a lot of you do as well. Um, but I have found a workaround. Uh, you can use the old snipping tool from Windows 10 if you've uh, directly upgraded from Windows 10 to Windows 11. So I don't know why I clicked on that. So you go to um, File Explorer here at the bottom and just type in this. So this is what you want to type in. C colon backslash windows dot old backslash windows backslash system 32 backslash snipping tool dot exe. You can go into the system itself and find it going through that through all that nonsense. But just type it into the, the top of the browser there. OK, so I'll click it in and bump up it comes. OK, if you typed it in, you just have to click enter. Um, but I already I'd already used it before, so I could just click the drop down box and it was already there. So there it is. And it works and it still works fine. Ta -da! And it will work OK. So that's a quick little workaround for now. I hope it does get sorted out. It's bound to be a, a few teething issues, but I'm surprised, you know, all this hype about Windows 11. I'm surprised that that, that hasn't been uh, spotted. But there we are. There's what it is. At least uh, there's a workaround for you for now if you want to use Snipping Tool until they resolve the issue. Anyway, thanks for watching. Subscribe, like, all that nonsense. I'll catch you in the next video.